recognize your footsteps all there. <laughs> We're gonna see the, we're gonna see it. Maybe we don't see it. Maybe it sucks the, the, the whole thing down. Bless the coming and going of him. May his passage cleanse the world. That's cool. And keep the world for his people. Ew, ew, what is happening there? What is that? Ew! It's like hairy. That is gross. That was like, that looked, that looked gross. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what it looked like. I think everybody knows what it looked like. Hi guys, and welcome back to Popcorn Roulette. My name is Kobe. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. You can stay up to date with all things Popcorn Roulette over on Instagram too which is Popcorn Roulette Reactions, and you can stay up to date with me personally if you want to at Kobe Connell on Instagram. So today I am starting something completely new in terms of like, you know, a series or a franchise. Um, I have put it off ever since I heard about it <laughs> because I thought it was not in my genre, uh, you know, not in my favorite genres of being sci-fi and, and stuff that I just normally steer clear from. I mean, we all know I've waited, you know, a long time to watch Star Wars. So today I am watching Dune, the first one. Now, all I know about it is it is sci-fi. I think I was told that, I don't know whether it's fact or just assumed, but because it's a book that's been around for a long time that George Lucas definitely watched, uh, read it, you know? So I don't know if it's something that he said, but I feel like it's something that is sort of universally accepted that like, oh, he read this growing up and sort of it is somewhat inspired him to, to create Star Wars, I think. That might be wrong, that might be right. Let me know in the comments. Um, but yeah, other than that, I think I know a few of the cast members I'm expecting to see, and that's just from news articles and stuff, you know, that I've that I've seen, which is Timothy Chalamet, Zendaya, and Austin Butler. That's all I know. So that's all I got. I feel like it's gonna be dusty and long and stressful. <laughs> And I really hope I like it. So for the full watch along, head over to our Patreon. And with that, let's get into Dune. Oh my gosh. Immediately. Dreams are messages from the deep. Oh, but it did that before the Warner Brothers title card? I'm getting the feeling this would have been something good to see on the big uh, cinema screen. My TV's pretty big though, so we're doing okay. How long is it? Six hours? <laughs> Nightfall, the spice harvester's land. The outsiders race against time to avoid the heat of the day. Oh, well, that's Zendaya's voice. I know that much, I think. They ravage our lands in front of our eyes. There she is. The Harkonnens. By controlling spice production, they became obscenely rich. Who is that? By imperial decree, they were gone. Look at the size of those ships. And who will our next oppressors be? Part one. Okay, so they're free for a minute from them. I have the feeling that it won't be for long. There he is, Chalamet. It's a little in the future. <laughs> you want it? Let me give it to you. Use the voice. Mom, I just woke up. What voice? The voice can't hear you. Come on, me. I want it to be really different and deep and scary. Give me the water. Hey, what are desert skills take years to learn for? Ha! Huh. I'm a bit tired. It's a little the four C Jedi ish, right? Outside the cities of Iraq is truly hostile. Sandstorms powerful enough to cut through metal. Oof. Fremen share the deep desert with the giant sandworms, known to the Fremen as Shai Hulud. Long exposure to spice has given the tribe their characteristic blue eyes. Ah. For the Fremen, spice is the sacred hallucinogen. For the Imperium. Without spice, interstellar travel is impossible. Hmm. The most 
valuable substance in the universe. Oh. Oh, I didn't realize they were gonna be rivals. For some reason, I thought they were like, this, I mean, I, like I said, I don't know anything, but I thought they were just like brother and sister or not brother, I, I don't know. I just thought they were the same thing, but obviously they are. Oh, is that Oscar Isaac? So he's in this and Star Wars. Smile, Gurney. I am smiling. And Josh Brolin? Yeah. We build navigators a total of 1.46 million 62 Solaris round trip. And I've seen him, but I don't remember his name. But it's Oscar Isaac and Brolin. House Atreides shall immediately take control of Arrakis. Do you accept? House Atreides, accept! Atreides! 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 But I'm confused. Is it peace that he said we, bring, we want to bring peace to Arrakis, but everybody... Else just wants to strip them of the spice, so is that what? Come on, let's watch. It's done. I don't really know what was agreed upon just then. But it does look phenomenal. Like, it's like expensive looking Star Wars, you know? Looks good. Oh boy. <laughs> Is that going to be Austin Butler? You going to Arrakis tomorrow. With the advanced team. Oh no! Yeah, I'm going to Arrakis tomorrow with the advanced team. Uh, Jason Momoa! I'd like you to take me with you. You would. Let's do that, because no. I wonder if he has to sneak away. I've been having dreams about Arrakis and the Fremen. Does he remember her from another time, or it's like in a, a vision and he's never met her? I saw you with the Fremen. So I do find them. Oh, is that? Oh, it's visions. It's omens. Okay. I saw you lying dead, fallen in battle. I felt like if I had been there, you'd be alive. Oh. We can make good stories. Everything important happens when we're awake. So if only make things happen. Yeah, you know, the muscle. <laughs> I don't think <No>. so. <laughs> See you in Arrakis, my boy. Because he's got whatever their version of the Force. This even looks like, it literally looks like what I just watched. It looks like, um... Father, I'd like to ask to join Duncan Idaho on a scout mission to Arrakis tomorrow. The Last Jedi. The great houses look to us for leadership, and it threatens the Emperor. By taking Arrakis from the Harkonnens and making it ours, he sets the stage for a war. Hmm. By making an alliance with the Fremen. I want you sitting in on my council. Learn what I do. Well, if I'm not dead... I told my father I didn't want this here. I wanted to be a pilot. Yeah, <laughs> like Poe. Grandfather said, a great man doesn't seek to lead. He's called to it. Hmm. And he answers. I like that. I found my own way to it. Maybe you'll find yours. Give it a try. He wants to make a, a like a deal with the firm and a, like a peaceful agreement, but they don't need anything, right? Like all these people that want to come there and steal spice and harvest spice, they don't need them. By your footsteps, Gurney Halley. Someone might imitate my stride. Roland. Choose your blade. Had quite a day, Gurney. Give us a song instead. <laughs> oh! What? what is that? Oh, we're getting fancy. I forget we're all like in the year a million. No, what was it? 10,191? <laughs> It's all very well done. I mean, I don't hate it. Guess I'm not in the mood today. What's mood to do with it? You fight when the necessity arises, no matter the mood. Now fight! Is the blue like a shield? Uh, oh, that's why it's red. Look down, my lord. You to join me in death. I see you found the mood. Red if it's like a kill shot. It won't be that bad. You don't really understand the grave nature of what's happening to us. Eyes, I need to see it in your eyes. You never met Harkonnens before. I have. They're not human. They're brutal. You have to be ready. They look like a uh, dressmaker dummies. Is that the Batista, Dave Batista, Dave Batista guy? Lord Barrett, the last of our ships have left Arrakis. I think so. 
Your traitor's voice is rising. The emperor is a jealous man. He has like a little Palpatine quality to him, too. But he's not even the emperor. I know her too, but I cannot think of her name and it will not come to me. I'm not close at all. Then again, I might have just seen her in Dune promos, you know? Get dressed and come with me. Is she gonna send him with Jason Momoa off with the first troops? Who is it? The Reverend Mother Guy Selim Wahim is here. She's now truth say to the Emperor himself. We would like to meet you. We want to know about your dreams. I don't even know about my dream. <laughs> Why is that you were here? Mm -hmm. Hello, well, your master. You might ask me to check your vitals. Far as strong as ever, buddy. She just what? She just knows that her son is powerful, and she's worried about it, and wants to know what he sees in the dreams. Okay. Come here. Neil. Oh, she does the same ordering. How dare you use the voice on me? The voice. Instead of the force. Very parallel. Put your right hand in the box. I hold it to your neck the gom java. Poison needle. Yeah. The test is simple. Remove your hand from the box and you die. What's in the box? Pain. What's in the box? What's in the box? Why are you doing this? Mm. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? <laughs> wait, 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 it's hurting her? What's... Silence! <laughs> Fear's the mind killer. Fear. It's the little death that brings obliteration. Mm. They're communicating? Can he hear that? Yeah. I do like that sound, that note. But how is that whole stressful, intense thing worse than just sitting there? If you had been unable to control your impulses like an animal. Oh, but it was that pain that he was feeling. You inherit too much power. Okay. No, because I'm the Duke's son. Because you are Jessica's son. Oh, the mom is the powerful one. Tell me about these dreams. What did you see? A girl on a rackers. Have you dreamt of her before? Yes. Many times. You often dream things that happen just as you dreamed them. Not exactly. Goodbye, young human. <laughs> so much potential wasted in a male. You were told to bear only daughters. You are told. He is the one. He has a long way to go. His sight is barely awakened, and now he goes into the fire. He's the one! He's like Neo! On Arrakis, we have done all we can. The path has been laid. Let's hope he doesn't squander. Okay, so he has like this otherworldly path and mission different to like his father's, you know, troops and soldiers and, and treaty plan. Much bigger. But when I said, how is all of that squirming or whatever different to just sitting there and waiting? It's because that's how painful it was. He was literally in that much pain dying and just couldn't move into the needle. So I apologize for, uh, to Timothy for being like, why don't you just sit there calmly? You fear the politics of the Imperium from the shadows. Oh, since obvious, we've been careful as bloodlines bring forth a one. A mind is the one. Into a better future. More part of the plan. I mean, the effects are awesome. I hope we get more of those big mm, when we're kind of getting it now, but when it's like that first. Yeah, this literally looks like where Mark Hamill, where Luke Skywalker was hiding out in the in the sequel trilogy. <laughs> With the uh Porgs and whatnot. I like the score. It's, it's kind of like a more rock version of Star Wars. You know, it's like a darker, heavier. I like it so far. Wait, this is landing on Arrakis. My lungs taste the air of time on past fallen sand. 
Some bagpipes, okay. The styling and the art direction, um, very cool, all of this. And they all have the blue eyes from the spice. Atreides! Let's get it! What are they showing? Listen, al It's their name for Messiah. These people have waited for centuries for the Lizan al -Gaib. They see you, they see the signs. <laughs> I like that it's all these like crazy names. Names and words and interesting places. And then his name is Paul. <laughs> They're like dragonflies, so they look like, I like it. Protects the city from the weather and the worms. I want to see a worm. I want to see a sandworm. I hope it's huge. Also kind of Star Wars-y, right? Wow. So quiet, it worries me too. Look at it all, I do love it. It's, uh, it's aesthetic, everything. I'm getting too high. I need to seal the doors. It gets that hot that you die. Candidates for a housekeeper, my lady. <gasps> Zendaya. I know that you have a weapon concealed in your bodice, my Athena. A weapon was meant as a gift. I was about to say nice cover, but I think it's real. I think she means that. Hey, it's a crisp knife. <laughs> What? The maker of the deep desert. I'm shy. The eyes are wild. I love it. I used to want blue eyes very badly. I don't know deep palms could even be found out here. You aren't indigenous. No. Each one of these drinks every day the equivalent of five men. Twenty palm trees. What? We removed them. Save the water. Oh, these are sacred. Old dream. Dangerous organism on Arrakis. The burned one. Capable of reaching 400 meters. 400 meters. Using the sound walk. A dance like motion with irregular rhythm, which emulates the natural sounds of the Maybe that weird glug, 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 gargle from the very, very beginning. Maybe that's the sandworm sound because he said they make a weird sound. And this whole film, remember, it started before even the Warner Brothers title card. It went glug, glug, glug. But he's in his own place. Who sent this little in? This little, this little in. This little thing in. His mom that still has like trust issues. <laughs> It's a hunter seeker. The operator must be nearby. Why? Well, we've had that something like that in something, a hunter seeker. I, I failed you today. There's no excuse. You would deprive us of your talents at this time. I am on a demand. They tried to take the life of my son! My pet doesn't understand your language. Get out! Mmm! How big is that? We play to Atreides means nothing to our order. Hmm. His wife is under our protection, and by extension, her son. Hmm. Allow them the dignity of exile. I give you my word. We will not harm them. That's not exile, though. Oh, look at his neck. If Duke's son lives. No, I pray it is. I say I will not harm them. And the desert takes the weak. My Iraqis. Why do? It's not going to protect them at all. You just. Arkans were taking 10 billion solaris out of here every year. We won't see profits like that for a while, not with the equipment they left us. How bad is it? Look at his little sun umbrella. It's like a little cocktail umbrella. <laughs> we're meant to fill every crate. Through to the Emperor Point, Dr. Liet Kynes, Imperial Ecologist, been here 20 years. Have this judge of the change accompany us. The meeting's long overdue. A hostage. I love it. Mm -mm. He's here, my lord. The dragonflies. I love these old things. For four weeks, I lived with the Fremen. Hidden in the desert in a community called the Siege. That's what he could see in that omen. Siege. How was it hidden? Underground. Arrakis is filled with caverns. How big is the place? 
get that down people. Millions of women, you were right. The Hawkenden estimate was 50,000 on the whole planet. <laughs> Finally, they sent a warrior out to kill me, and I should tell you, I've never come so close to dying. <gasps> they fight like demons. Yes, with power, Duncan. Well done. Did he kill the Furman then? Still go. Sir, I respect the personal dignity of any man that respects mine. <laughs> Hold. We accept it in the spirit in which it was given. Oh, it was a gift. Disgusting. You are outworlders. You come here for the spice. You take it, giving nothing in return. I love Javier Bardem. True. But your features will be yours forever, and you will never be hunted while I govern here. Okay, so he really is trying to have peace. That's all I have to say to you. Won't you stay? We would honor you. Thank you. From what? Or just from... Land bears fruit. But it will take time. It will take time. He recognizes him from just like the fable and like what's meant to happen in the, you know, the prophecy or from physically. That's the same part. Hmm. <laughs> My God, man, you've gone native. <laughs> you admire them. Yeah. They're fierce, but loyal. The king of the desert, part of it. It's part of them. Wait till you see it. I wonder when Jason Momoa fought to the almost death, did he kill the other person, the other guy, and then Javier Bardem is just the person like that came with him, or was that who he was? I think that's who he fought, right? That's why he said no other fighter like it, and then he introduced him. So I guess they just came to the point of like almost dying, and he let him live. Yeah, I'm gonna assume that that's who he fought and who he called the best fighter. Otherwise, he killed an, a uh, one of the Fairman. Is it? Fremen or Furman? Fre 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 Furman? Um, which I don't think he did. No. That was who he fought. Thanks for coming full circle on that thought with me. <laughs> You're the Imperial Ecologist. Thank you for the still suits. They are Fremen make. Fremen. Your permission, sire. I must check the integrity of your Oh. I think I was calling them Furman, which sounded way too much like vermin. Fremen. Still suit is a high efficiency filtration system. You wouldn't survive two hours without one of them. Really? Let's have a look at you, lad. You want a still suit before? No, this is my first time. Your desert boots are fitted with slip fashion at the ankles. Who taught you to do that? In the right way. Thank you for saying that you could lad. <gasps> He's the one! I was so excited. No. Come and see the spy sands on which your livelihood. Depends. I got goosebumps when she said that, that he will know your ways as if he was one or from whatever she said. <laughs> the locals, though, don't need the whole soup, but they still have the little tube, right? Zendaya had the little water tube, um, but I'm pretty sure they just have like their normal clothes, unless they have like the raggedy clothing over those still suits, but I, I don't think so. I think that's just for tourists, no? That's Cloud. One of your harvesters. The score is everything. You see these spotter aircraft looking for worm sign. I want to see a worm. <laughs> if you are patient, you should see one. It's like tremors. Is that a worm? <gasps> Come on, baby. Let's go worm wave. Where, 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 where? Big one. <laughs> Worm sign north and east of you. 3.7 kilometers. Worm is on the intercept course to your position. Contact in five minutes. What happens now? Yeah. They'll harvest right up to the last minute. Calling Cario Alpha Zero. Oh. Oh, you don't, you don't beat the worm. You just remove the harvester. Anybody got a visual on the carry-on? There it is. Wow. Approaching from your east. Correcting altitude and preparing backing in. If this thing is going to jump out of the sand as it's being lifted away, I hope so. Prepare to be airborne in 30 seconds. Docking sequence initiated. Brace yourselves. That wasn't five minutes. Where's the worm? Alpha Zero, we're short one point of contact. <laughs> Surely you don't need all of them. Any carry on the sector, please respond. 
No. How many men on that crawl? They had like six anchors. Surely it works without one of them. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I want you at the back of the softer. Guide them in. The worm would be there. He was so close. He's not been there, but he has, right? Can some people go in that thing or no? Getting close, guys. We better abandon ship now. Oh, that's what the five minutes was, the worm. So now it's two minutes away. Besides, we got a full load of spice. We can't just leave Damn it. the spice! I want every man off that crawler now! Uh Let me see. Oh, it was still just like disrupted sand. It wasn't the front of the worm. Seven over here, seven over there. So he doesn't wear the mask, the tube, nothing. No, but even Zendaya, the local, has the tube, so he can't be. He must need it. That is the worm noise. The worm gargling. Oh, it talks. <laughs> okay. I think. <laughs> they didn't talk in Tremors. We're gonna see the, we're gonna see it. Maybe we don't see it. Maybe it sucks the, the, the whole thing down. Bless the coming and going of him. May his passage cleanse the world. That's cool. And keep the world for his people. Ew, ew, what is happening there? What is that? Ew! It's like hairy. That is gross. That was like, that looked, that looked gross. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what it looked like. I think everybody knows what it looked like. If I don't get spice production back on track. I'm not here to take your part. <sighs> they don't care, but they do care about Paul. Take good care of your family. This is not kind to human. Mm. Where do I know the mother from? Gosh. You need to be sensitive. You'll be fine. Mm reaction but he breeds in so much of it you know like he's not allergic to it at all that's what he's saying I guess I guess and really hasn't been in it much other than these couple of visions oh my gosh here I was smiling I was like oh cute they're gonna fall in love Life is important. Maybe. Someone will hand me a blade. Uh, I know you're pregnant. Why? He knows everything. It's only been a few weeks. It's the force. It's the voice. It's ooh. Maybe his dad's death if it's not his own. Um, because his dad is a good guy, you know, trying to do this peacefully, but still wants to harvest all the spice. So I guess there's still this like selfish intention. Trade these legions are the finest in the Imperium, trained by Gurney Alec in Duncan, Idaho. <laughs> Sounds a lot like a didgeridoo. Ever since you brought him before your Reverend Mother, he hasn't been the same. He's distracted. That didn't do it. He was already having the dreams. Now I'm asking you this one thing. If anything happens, will you protect our son? Yeah, of course. My life. I'm not asking his mother. I'm asking the Bene Gesserit. Oh. How old is he meant to be? Because he's so um, slight of frame. Um, he looks really young. You need to sleep. No, not like that. I should be married. What?
security. No. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, but the shield is not going to go. Is it? Ah. Oh. It went through. Oh, so it's just for a second. It. Oh, it doesn't protect you. Definitely. The shield's come down. Get everything with guns off the ground. Go. Of course, it's at night, and on the black TV, I can't see as well. <laughs> Where's uh, Paul? Where's Chalamet? Not that he's a soldier, like, boots on the ground like that. He's, like, protected wherever he is, but is he awake? I feel like, you know, because I know there's a Dune 2, I'm like, Josh Brolin's not going to die and everybody's going to be okay because they're all in Dune 2, I think, but I don't know. The only one I know for sure in Dune 2 is Zendaya, Zendaya and, um, and Chalamet. I don't know about Oscar Isaac. I didn't even know he was in this one. I don't know about Josh Brolin. Didn't even know he was in this one. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh man. Oh. Robin has had my wife, Mona. I will buy her freedom. You are the price. Ah. Oh. For Paul, I will do what I can. You know, you are meant for me. Wait, that's it? That one. Your back tooth, you know, you will fill the air with poison. But that's it. I thought, okay, well, just as I was saying, I don't know who makes it to the next one. That's it. That's Oscar Isaac out. That little tiny arrow thing? I guess it was like the one that the witch lady held to his neck. That's it? Who's he going to take out with his little cyanide gassy bond tooth trick? Oh, no red. So the shields do nothing. Oh, they took them. And just as well for us because because the worms will not eat him. I can't speak for the mother because I don't know if she's in the sequel. But we know that the Paul's gonna be okay. Oh come on. Is that Momoa? Sometimes it's so hard to see. That was cool how uh, how Oscar Isaac piloted it down to the uh, down to the worm when they were doing that rescue, and it just like contracted all its wings and went and like dove straight down. Whew. Like that ish. He's good. He's out. He's fine. This guy's probably not even going to get his wife. Let me the kid to the world. I give her a long goodbye. Don't you dare touch my mother. Uh oh.
He's gonna do it. You are ready. Remove her gag. He's just gonna stand up and hit you. Do it, do it, do it. No, 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 no. Say something. Order him. <laughs> oh, so she can do it too. She's that good. She, ah. Set her free. Get me the knife. I'll cut my rope, okay. was too forced. Okay, can we like get the critique later? Cause he did it. I don't know, maybe that's helpful that she tells him in case he needs to use it again right now. They've crippled the ship. Whew. And they don't know about Oscar Isaac? Or can they sense it like the force? Hmm. Uh. They put him just dying like that at the end of the table. He's a ducky, you always say, right? If anyone makes it out of Arakeen alive, that loon will be able to find you. <sighs> what do you want? I give you for the Duke and his family. And what will I do for you? Give you for my wife from Arakeen. I won't. It's always a sucker's deal. Said I'd set her free. That you could join her. So join her. Oh, oh! He didn't even just kill the woman already. He killed her and then him for nothing. Like I mean, he did the deal for nothing. You can't trust them. Your son is dead. Your concubine is dead. Night, the house of a trade is full. And your bloodline ends forever. <sighs> what did he say? Did he turn the shield off to lean in or turn it on? Because that might protect him from the gas. Yeah. <sighs> that happened right after I said I don't know if Oscar Isaac or Josh Brolin are in the next one. Fine! Would you tell the great house of the Landsrat how we were betrayed? I am commanded to say nothing. Hmm. But at least he got them all. Like, I thought he was gonna get one. And I guess that's what the doctor said. Pick your moment. <laughs> Spicy attack. It's pretty. He does end up with that little tube, though, I'm sure. So she hasn't said a word yet, right? There's been a couple of visions, and they kissed, and she stabbed him. Is that it? And these, like, look backs and enticing, sort of like, come hither eyes. They're even different people. They're not like the Harkonians or whatever. Oh, Tim! What'd he say? Retribution is coming. Somebody help me, please. What? 
Salty? The little thing. Ah! I do like it! That's what he saw in that little vision he had in his room. Look at its little ears. Oh, it looks like you! Very cute. Is it? It's an old ecological test in the station. Free the water locked beneath the sand. The work had begun, but then the spice was discovered. Suddenly, mm. no one wanted the desert to go away. Hmm. Tana. Who are you to the front line? So when Oscar Isaac, when when he bit that pill and did you bear witness? Testify that the Emperor has moved against us here. And the Emperor has no sons. And his daughters are yet to marry. You'd make a play for the throne. The Emperor feared the Atreides. He brought you here to kill you. Son of the speaker, who is Sarn al Gaib. A voice from the outer world who will lead them to paradise. That's me. I know you loved a friendly warrior and lost him in battle. I know you walk in two worlds that are known by many names. She's also the one that dressed him and was like, you know how to do your boots. I've seen your dream. Mm-mm. What's he doing? Darker! <gasps> this is where, this is the vision, this is the same room, this is the room where they're all laying dead. No! That was the premonition. Oh, we're gonna lose Momoa too, Duncan. It's gonna do okay for a bit, right? This is the room, this is all of it. Change it. Red. Red. No, you have no choice. Uh. He's still gonna die, but he's killed the last few that were gonna go in there. Till his last, last breath. Oh boy, you'll find a thopter ready to fly. You don't come in with us. It only seats two. Oh man. I bet because I know there's a part two, I bet this is gonna leave me like, um, was it Empire? Which one just ends and you're just like, ah. Maybe Zendaya doesn't even talk in the first one, in part one. I don't know how long I've been watching. I don't know if I'm close to like, cause it's like three hours, right? Each part. They're also very like Edward Scissorhands' hands, the blades. Oh, what 
they call it a sand blaster or sand something? Oh, it's bringing a worm. Are we gonna see more of the worm or just the just the butthole face again? I want it to like breach like whales do, like right out of the sand. I serve only one master. His name is Shai Halud. Oh, it's gonna take them all. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't like the like the spikes, the hairs, but I don't like it. <laughs> I'm not confident on the mom. Like, he might have to lose everything and everyone he loves. I hope she doesn't die too. His best friend, his dad. Hopefully she stays. The mystery of life isn't a problem to solve. We must move with the flow of the process. Them into a Coriolis storm. Winds at 800 kilometers an hour. Please. Nothing survives such a storm. They're dead. I hope she. I know he's not. I hope she's not. At work, Daddy Prime begins selling us prize reserve. I want the prize to fall. I have no idea how much it costs me to bring such a force to bear here. No, I only have one requirement. Can you come and affirm it? Kill them all. Mm -hmm. Kill them all. They think there's 50,000 all up. There's millions. He has, doesn't have any idea. So what I was confused about before is when Oscar Isaac bit his tooth and gassed all those people, I thought he gassed that guy, the main baddie. Um, but he kills everyone in that room. But then when they went back in, there was someone spluttering up top. Was that him? And he floated up and, and was like, and didn't actually die because he didn't get enough of it? I didn't think so. Uh. <laughs> He's doing a pretty good job. As soon as we land, run for the rock. As soon as we land. Okay. Brace position. Okay, but now that they're in the middle of Spice, Spice World, Spice World the movie. That's why they want the rocks. He's the only part without all of the sort of dust and s s spice, I guess. Come on, guys. I was nervous that he'd lose her too, but now I don't know. I'm like quietly confident that maybe she'll survive and it'll be the two of them. Even, even to the end of two, maybe. Although normally I say something like that and the person lasts about five seconds. I'm nervous. I keep chewing my lip. I'm like, <laughs> warm wave. Now we have to find the premise. I was going to say that looked like Jason Momoa, but that was from the vision. Yeah, I was going to say, this is what he saw with her before, but they weren't wearing those s still suits. 
Do you find that my little desert mouse can survive? You need to face your fears. Oh, I feel like it's gonna end. Not much to learn. Now I will show you the ways of the desert. The siege where Duncan lived. Somewhere off that way. Hmm. I can't say green or yellow. That means Fremen lived there. You can't walk like regular humans. You do, we're dead. You have to walk like the ice skating. According to the phone books back home. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, follow me. Do the same moves. This is the right direction. That's different though. Like that's, although it does sound like the sand wave coming with the worm, but normally when it's the worm, it's also that as well, right? <laughs> Hand of God. Close by. Let's get out of here. Right. He's from Sam. Run! One. Oh! Oh, I thought they found the Furman. I thought they found the, like, the, where they live. It's gonna be, or it is a worm. Yeah, 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 it's the worm sand. I just thought for a second, maybe. <sighs> what is happening? He's stopping it, or it knows that it's him? It's a thumper. Someone set off a thumper. Oh no, he's just sensing where the thumper is coming from, from before, and now he's, and he was just getting his bearings, but their little moonwalk was getting him confused, and now he's gone off towards the, the thumper. I thought he had like power over it, and he was doing, you know, the force, the voice, the, but he didn't say anything, but I thought it sensed that he was like the one, and the worms were in cahoots. It's gonna be Zendaya, finally. Do not run. You will only waste your body's water. Oh. Is it Javier? I can't see. It's so dark. You know me. I was there when you came to my father's council. Yeah. This is the boy I told you about. My thumper saved his life. Go back to reason still, Gar. He's not the one. He's the one! You help us off world to Caliban, you will be well rewarded. What wealth can you offer beyond the water in your flesh? Mm. Go is young, he can learn our ways. He may have sanctuary, but the woman mm -mm. isn't trained. I'm too old to learn. Also, Timothy Chalamet doesn't know that Zendaya is a real person, right? Like he's had visions, but I guess the visions he has are of real people. But he doesn't know that I think that he's probably very close to her. Like maybe she's in this. <laughs> She'll cut my throat. <laughs> Why didn't you say you were a weirding woman? <laughs> Conversation ran short. Peace. Yasha Hakum, Majira la Sipstabra, Gonna lick us at Siha. More traveling. Gumanara shows, Gonna belly Hia, Kurimi Unak. I would not have let you hurt my friends. Here she is. This is what I mean by he doesn't know. He didn't know. And she's right there. They say you are the Mahdi. You look like a little boy. Hmm. <laughs> Give it to me. Can you take charge of the newcomers? I will not have them. Mm -mm. Mm. You talk like a leader. I invoke the untold. Do not challenge Esayadina. Then who will fight in her? Where is our champion? I accept her champion. This is maybe the knife that he saw. Is he fighting? Look, we said that to rise. But then he thought it wasn't his death. I don't believe you have a lease on Al Gaid. I don't want you to die with honor. It's 
Chris knife was given to me by my great aunt. Uh-uh. The great Sanrio. This will be a great honor for you to die holding. Where's the outworld? Just no chance that he wouldn't die. You know what I mean? She's like, we know he lives. So at least we can relax. What? <gasps> so they do all have the still suits on though, uh, the Furman, the, the locals. I was thinking for a minute that they didn't need it, but they still do just because the spice has changed their eyes. They still all wear one with the tube under, you know, the coats or the blankets or whatever. Well, he's gonna win, right? But it's a bit like the Matrix in the sense that, like, Neo's the one. As long as he believes he's the one, there's other options for the one. It's all about what you do with that information, right? May thy knife chip and shudder. May thy knife chip and shudder. Welcome, my blade. This world will kill you. He's gonna kill you. But he's... Mm. But he also isn't bad, so like, does he want to kill one of their men? <laughs> Very close to the people. There's no yielding under the Amta rule. Only death is the test of it. Oh, there is no yield. He has to kill him. You're going with him. No, Thor has never killed a man. He's about to. He had no choice. He didn't want to. She's starting to believe that he's the one. And now he's gonna lead them all to freedom. <laughs> You're one of us now. A life for a life. Come with us, who sits there. Well, like a prisoner, though. Who needs to get off world? You must have ways, you have. My father came, not for spice, not for the riches. For peace. For the strength of your people. And I'll do the same. I can see it. <laughs> we will come. Oh, this is going to be the end, isn't it? He's grown up already, like in the last, you know, three hours. Desert power. This is only the beginning. Whoa. Oh, he's going to ride a worm. And they're gonna fall in love. And she might die. She also got a bit weirdly like protective y jealousy strange. Ha! <sighs> oh, it's Dennis Villeneuve. That's why, like, it looks, I mean, it looks incredible. That was. I can't believe I watched Dune. That was wild. I didn't, I was about to say I didn't hate it, but that's not true because I actually enjoyed it. It was beautiful, like it looked amazing. Maybe it's like a little long considering I'm only really halfway through the story and I have a whole nother part to go. But, um, but I enjoyed it. I feel like it's like a, I feel like it's like a sexier Star Wars, you know? And um, aesthetically it's just simple and clean, ironically, because it's full of filth and dust and sand and dirt. Um, but it just, yeah, it looks stunning. It's slick. It's sort of like a, 
It's like in a beautiful music video. <laughs> um, but all the performance. Oh, Stellan Skarsgård. That's who was the bad, bad guy. He just had extra prosthetic neck and stuff put in. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Any other names do I recognize? Oh, Charlotte Rampling. That's... No, who was that? Was that the mom? Or was that the evil witch? Um, it was fun. I actually am now excited to watch part two. I think maybe Austin Butler is in the second part because I don't think I made that up completely. Uh, but it was, it was great. And I tell you what, it didn't feel like three hours. I think it's like two and a half or something, two hours and 45. Um, it didn't feel that way. So while I said before, say it before, um, while I said before it was like a little long, eh, maybe it's just because I know I'm only mentally halfway through the story. But I do think it was, I do think it didn't feel draggy and uh, I really enjoyed it. So thanks for watching with me. I hope you guys come back for part two. My name is Kobe. This is Cash. And you've been watching here on Popcorn Roulette. See you next time. Hey.